on the off the field and work overtime On the court or not, I take charge of mine Beast mode when it's game time Turn the base up when they play mine Sports base and you know it's live We on front Radio man, special live event man. We live at our our daytime party. You already know, man. You with Quan the Maven, Young Rain. I mean, we up in here, Mr. Z. What? What you go by? AKA the two Dab times. Daddy. Oh, two my times. Bad. Two we got two good. times up in here. Of course, man. Our second segment, we gonna have Tyson up in this motherfucker like he always is. And man, eating right now, so we ain't gonna disturb. Him. Hell yeah. All right. So I mean, this is just a free ball type of type of event or whatever. So we are gonna just talk about a little bit of everything. First and foremost, we are gonna talk about this NFL, man. We wanna talk about who's the team to beat up in the NFL. Who's gonna be lead dog? Who is our Super Bowl prediction? Who's gonna win it? I mean, I mean, of course, Zeke, you say, you say, you know, the Eagles is... It's common sense. The champion is the one on the top. That's who you want to beat. That's for any sport. Uh, Golden State, the team to beat. In basketball. In football, it's the Eagles. I don't know, man. And, and it's a different caliber, you know what I'm saying? Because in, in football, I, don't, I mean, though, I, I give it to the Eagles. They play their heart out or whatever. Like, like, you looking yeah. like you ready. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, he ready to chime yeah. in already. He yeah. ready to yeah. chime yeah. in. <laughs> But look, I mean, but I don't think that, I mean, though they were a good team last year, I don't think that they're the team to be only because, A, they let, they let go of some good pieces or whatever. Um, hey, little man. Yeah, go open the door real quick. Yeah, that's open. That's open. It's open over there. Yes, man. Yeah, I mean, they were the team to beat last year, but they didn't got rid of some key pieces or whatever. First and foremost, you know, they didn't got rid of LeGarrette Blunt, which he went to my Detroit Lions. And and then they got rid of like a bunch of their their linemen or whatever. Though they did pick up uh, Nagata from, you know, my Detroit Lions, or whatever. They can have him though, or whatever, because he was injury prone, or whatever. But I mean, I don't think that I don't think personally that they're the team to beat. I mean, I'm, if I had to go on a limb to say, I would say it's the Rams. Mm. I would say, or whatever. Not but a bad choice. yeah, no, that ain't a bad I, choice. Can, I mean, can, I, can, can I can I go ahead chime in, bro? It's your time. I just want to go because I'm sick and tired of all the the, <laughs> the NBA and NFL cliches type shit. Uh, like, that's what you, you want? Do, baseball, hockey? No. To, to, <laughs> to just to just <laughs> go on a limb and uh, to just go on a limb and say that that because you're the the the, the champion that you uh, are the team to beat. It's blasphemy to me. Well, okay. And, and, and no, no, no. Go let ahead. me, let me, you let me. Yeah, let go me ahead. Let him chime in. I want right. your head. And I say that because because Golden State done it and been in the finals four years. I mean, that, that's different. I mean, they're the best team in the NBA. Yeah, yeah. I mean, and they got a team full yeah, of all stars. They're the top ten players in the NBA. That's right. But I mean, we're talking about football. Agree. You're talking about a game. To whereas if you can figure your opponent out, they become a lesser version of themselves. Exactly. I mean, the Patriots are in in the chip every year, but they don't win every year. Right. But that doesn't the Patriots necessarily make a great team. I feel you. So okay. Now listen, listen. I say all that to say this: football, Philadelphia Eagles, RPO offense, and that's pretty much what it have made a living off. Yeah. Right. You know because. They went like, what, 11 and 4 with what Carson Wentz? Wentz? Yeah. He gets hurt. Nick Foles is trash. He but got they him still, But they still win the Super Bowl. Yeah, yeah. They, he got so him there. So I think more so it was a product of the system. So not so much can you figure out the Eagles, but can you figure out this RPO in which Doug Peterson has installed in their offense? And they haven't can, figured it out. Well, yeah, it's one season. I mean, you couldn't yeah. figure out the Wildcat offense, but once you figure it out, yeah. it's dead. So, more of the story is you can't just say that the Eagles are the, the team to beat just because they won the Super Bowl. I don't think so. I, I personally I agree. Whoever said it's the Rams, I kind of agree with that. Yeah, but, but, I kind of feel like I kind of feel like that team was already headed to where they was headed to. Yeah. And then the only thing they did this offseason was add, add to more pieces. Before, to you it. had Dominican Sue. You had a keep to lead. Yeah. You had somebody in the middle of that defense, and then you add an elite corner on the outside. Yeah, I you. You're calling a few. Man, you last seven walks. Yeah, yeah. That's the thing I see. Yeah, All right, go ahead. But you, you've got to see them. You know, prove anything. See, you got to go by. Prove what? You have to go by what has already been done. For example, like what? You'll
They got a championship. They got a championship. Now, if you go to Golden State, they they don't won three out of four in the past four years. Are they the team to beat? Yeah. Oh yeah. All right. Why? I'm not. Why gonna are they any different than Philly? Because they better than everybody. Yeah, that's, and that's they've been opinion. better than everybody. But, but you can when, opinion. When, they won yeah, three out of you, four years. That's facts. not opinion. When you get facts, when you but when you get facts, you have to go by concrete evidence. Concrete evidence is what in football a Super Bowl. Yeah. They won that. You go to AFC. It's the Patriots. The Patriots were there. I mean, I don't believe they're the team to be in the AFC. Though. Who is the team to beat now? I don't see know, but you I said the Rams. I, I just don't believe it's the Patriots, though. They lost a lot of talent. They did, and I mean Tom yeah. Brady's like But they've 41. done that before. But they, Tom Brady's forty-one. Yeah, but at forty, he, he got on, MVP. He, he come on April. I mean April. He come on Oprah and say he sees the yeah. ending is near. But I, I think the end, if he says it, the ending is near. Yeah, but that's that's. I think that's a little stunt to, to throw people off. I mean, he he's saying the ending is near. He came with that same mess last year. He got the MVP in the NFL. <laughs> I don't think he said. I can shit. agree with that. Oh, whatever. Because he, 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 he didn't say that. He had last a little year. Facebook show. You're making up for a little Facebook show though. And, and he time, said the ending is near. I mean, I think he I mean, said he's he gonna play until he's 45. Then Roethlisberger he, come with that he mess wants too. To. And I bet you they're gonna be up there up front for the championship mm-hmm. too. Nah, I think. Well, I don't know because the thing about it is, I think I think this probably is gonna be. One of Ben's best years only because he's kind of competing with the young buck or whatever. You see how uh, when the young buck came along or whatever, teach him nothing. he said he didn't want to teach him. He, like, who wants to teach a motherfucker how to be just as good as them? Fuck the team or whatever. Like, at the end of the day or whatever. Like, well, of that's course, competitiveness. I don't know yeah, for that, but yeah. I understand. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I don't, I think that it's going to be one of Ben's best years only because he felt like he had something to prove. Or whatever, but I don't think that they're gonna be up there. Like with the ch- with the tr- changes that all, all these other teams, yeah, they are, they, they are. are. Like the Steelers, you can side. never, you can never, like you can never, like like just sleep on them or whatever because they're always there. For God, they're somewhere up in there. But think about this though, because you touched on the subject that that's a good point. You got Joe Flacco, you got Roethlisberger. You said you mentioned. Uh, oh, he wagged though, but Flacco. He wagged, but they yeah, Flacco wagged. If you believe you're still in your Ravens prime, fans, fuck yeah. If you believe you're still in your prime, <laughs> or you still got something in the tank, <laughs> you're not gonna give it up to the man that's right behind you trying to get your position. Fuck no. That's just like a, if you had a regular job. That's a sense of insecurity. Not necessarily. It's a, nah, it's I can say that competitiveness. Nah. Yeah, me too. It it's competitive. Oh, hell no, no. What's competitive? I'm going to teach gonna... you what I know, and I'm still going to kick your ass. Hell no. That's competitive. <laughs> competitive ain't, I'm not going to teach you this because I think you're going to take my job. Competitive That's a direct opposite of competitive. Your own. So what are we talking about? If that was the case, Garoppolo wouldn't be as good as he was for Sam. He's as good yeah. as he was because he's as good as he was. No, I think nah. that was because of the system. Yeah, and he had time great to teach yet. He, he was on the 49ers. He, went six he was on a system that's about winning. Seriously, he played for the 49ers last year. Four games. Yeah, but he, okay, he hadn't he lost yet. No, it's six games. But so that was because of oh, where he came from. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Yeah, he yeah. hadn't Let lost yet. Let me ask you something. Let's look, let's look at the trend here. Brissett was a good backup. When Who? He, Brissett. Brissett. Kobe. He got, he got yes, traded. Yes, but when, he Man. did. But he held his own when he came to the Colts. He did good. And let's look he at did. Castle. Yes, he did. I would say. Matt Castle was, like, was a Pro Bowl quarterback that year that he was with Kansas City. <laughs> with the Patriots. With the Patriots. No, no, no. But when he left Kansas City, he was a Pro Bowl quarterback Ooh. that year. Castle. Yeah, they ain't never was. done nothing. I'm just talking about somebody who. But I'm saying they never had that chance. I'm just talking about who wants a Super Bowl. No, so. but you got to. Wait, wait, wait. I understand that. But there's a lot of quarterbacks out there that yeah, have yeah, 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 yeah. But I mean, you know, I mean, it's like that. But you gotta look at the system. I give it to him. A part of that Patriot system is why San Francisco is flourishing right now. I agree. I believe that. Yeah. I don't know, man. I don't know, Do your homework on that. What I'm saying is, those systems don't go hand in hand. Like the 49ers and the Patriots system aren't the same. It's not. But what I'm saying is, the system as far as bringing up quarterbacks, things like that. I mean, you just gotta look at a pattern. Those quarterbacks that came out of the Patriot system started off at least decent. They probably the best one though. He's clearly the best one. And oh, you gotta yeah, think about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. You gotta think about yeah, it. Yeah, like, yeah, he was yeah. a second round pick, so obviously he has some talent of his own. He did have some talent. I mean, you that ain't got a little to talent, do with but the system. It, yes, it does. It does. He because was a second round pick. What was Brady? He was like a six round pick. Exactly. But what yeah, I'm but saying yeah, is, yeah, if you're a part, if you're a part of the system, if you're a part, I give it to this because you gotta look at how long they've been doing this. They've been winning since '99, bro. And I'm giving it to Tom Brady. No. no, I'm giving it to Tom Brady. No, it's Belichick, bro. No, it's Belichick. It like like it's both, it's both, I, yeah, it's both. both. See, both, I can't both, go. Both. I, it's, it's both. both. It's so, both. Why he never made it in Cleveland? Who? 
Because this is uh, oh! no, who makes it? Who makes it in Cleveland? <laughs> Oh, what does that got to do with Nancy? Hey, Hold on, wait. This year, this, this year, Cleveland going to be all right. Belichick I think Cleveland going to be all right. You know, I don't know how long. I know you got fire. He, oh, I, know, I know he had <laughs> sucky record after sucky record after sucky record. <laughs> and he got fired. So I know that. Shit, so yeah, tell but, me. So tell me. Yeah, but that doesn't equate fired? to what, what he's done in New England. What what has he done in New England? Okay. You want to look at Tom Brady. Brady. Oh, okay. Man, shit. Yeah, Tom Brady. I'm buying that. If that's how you feel, that's how you feel. Okay. All right, look, man. Like we got, we got what? We got like five more minutes left, or whatever. Like maybe four now, whatever. I'm a, I'm a. I'm gonna say this, yo. I'm a, I think that I think that personally, it's the Belichick or whatever. Like because like you you got players that that say right now. I think it was an interview with with Amendola or one of them. Or whatever that, players, yeah, they, they was like it's no fun. You know, it's no fun up in uh, at the Patriots like camp or whatever. Like it's all work or whatever. And whereas with other camps, they they focus more on like having fun with but, the game, but playing your game. You know. What I'm but saying? if that's how it works, everyone everything works differently. Right, right, if right. That's how. It but works. that's their system I give it, to you. It, it works I for them makes it or whatever so i i think is i think personally it's about shape but you know what i'm saying we about to go on hold you on. know our little short break hold on yeah. we got more to talk yeah, about man. we gonna go on a short break let our shit reset <laughs> right quick or whatever but sports base man special event right here let's go that's why though Sports base radio, man. We back, man. You already know how we finna do, man. We gonna touch a little bit about this NBA draft. Let these boys go ahead and take it away. We gonna talk a little bit about the free agency too, but we gonna take it away with the draft first, fellas. What's up? I just wanna get it started, man. In my opinion, the Phoenix Suns is back. <laughs> the, the Phoenix Suns is back. You know, it's almost like the equivalent of what the Spurs did oh my God. back in 98. Oh, they was man. trash. Are they going to make it even in the Western? They're going to make it to the playoffs, the 7th, 8th seed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me ask you this then. If they're going to make it in the playoffs, who from this year is not going to be in the playoffs? Who are they? Because somebody's got to go. Maybe so, the, maybe the Timberwolves. Uh, bruh. Shit. They don't um, play right. I like them, but they don't play right. They got a stack. Like a fifth seed this year. Yeah, they got like a stack. Who? Timberwolves. Yeah, Timberwolves an eighth seed. He was fighting to get in against Denver the last the last Denver's game. Right, but they didn't right. get swept. They didn't get swept. They didn't get swept. Go to say this. No. Go to say this. They lost to Houston. I mean, I thought Houston. <laughs> they got one out of Houston. They might have won a game, but yeah, shit, but that's a that's a gentleman sweep. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> wait a minute. All right, so you are saying Minnesota's going? The Suns are going to bump Minnesota. They're going to be look. You add DeAndre. You add DeAndre Aiden. You you. Nuggets though. Let me tell you. When, when so. you add, I when you no, nah, I, I got both nuggets. of them teams made. Okay, okay, okay. When you Shout add, when, nuggets, you, when you add DeAndre Ayton, you become fifty percent better than what you was before. That's a guaranteed dumping in two points. I got you. DeAndre Ayton, this uh, one, one thing about DeAndre Ayton, he got the Timmy Duncan effect. That's what I mean when I say it's almost like the Spurs who were trash, and then they get Timmy. You can't say the Wade Spurs. And then they want to, they want to ring. Who? The Spurs. Yes, what do you mean? They're trash. They were trash the year before, before they, oh, before oh, they got Tim Duncan. Yeah, yeah, they were trash the year before they. Right? You right? Yeah. You can't get Tim Duncan without being trash yeah, if you yeah, get him number yeah, one overall. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, okay. So in my opinion, I'm looking at it like the Spurs is that. I mean, the Suns is that, is that type of team. You finally get a big man who can play. You finally get a big man with a low post game, back to the basket game, face up game, mid range game. <laughs> You already you are, you already got you already got a budding superstar in Devin Booker, who averaged 25 points last year, who's capable in his fourth year of having the Kobe Bryant effect. You already got T.J. Warren, who averaged 20 points a game. You already got you already got a guy and yeah, just listen to me, just listen to me. I'm giving you some Maven shit. You already got it. You already got a guy in Josh Jackson. Who's a merging star? Who averaged 13 points a game, 20 points a game after the All Star game? So basically, what I'm saying is, if this team can get anything out of their new coach, if this team can actually get a point guard in free agency, they coming. You got all the scoring in the world. No longer do you got to deal with this trash Marquise Chris. No longer do you got to deal with this trash Dragon Bender. No longer do you got to do with any of this trash. This team is coming. And then you look at the Denver Nuggets. I ain't forgot hey. about them. You got the Joker. The Denver Tough. You got Jamal Murray. Nice. 
Yeah. You got Millsap. Now Michael Porter slid further than anybody ever thought he yeah, would. Most people, most hard. pundits thought he would go top five, at least top ten. Yeah. The dumbass Sixers. He went 12, 13. Don't even get me started with the Sixers. <laughs> don't even get me started. Don't even get me started with the Sixers. But anyway, if this boy back is healthy, Denver got him a guy. Yeah, yeah. He, they can do you like drugs. Yeah, he shouldn't have even right. been that low of a pick. Yeah, that was. Yeah, I mean, right. everybody, yeah, back is everybody was scared of his injury. Yeah. But you sleeping on the Suns, and I'm trying to tell you, you don't have to be that good of a, of a team to next year take that leap. You right. ain't you, you ain't looking at it right, man. Okay. <laughs> you, ain't, you, ain't, you ain't looking right. at it right. right. Zeke, take you, it away, bro. You, you Zeke, take it away. One team. All right. Honestly, I'm gonna be honest with you. His rookie season, he won't even be able to handle Rudy Gobert. Who? Oh. Eight. I don't know, bro. As far as what? No, as far as all those yeah, thing Brady. qualities you said he has, I don't think he gonna be able to do that his first year against Twenty eleven in college. Like. In college, college. It's college. It's it's freshman. All right. You don't know what Embiid averaged in college? Yeah, but, <laughs> yeah, but it took. Do you want to know what Embiid averaged in college? Embiid. Yeah, but he a rookie in his second year in the NBA. What? It took him two years. That's Embiid like. But I'm, yeah. but I'm talking yeah, about. I'm but, talking but about his even, first year playing. I ain't got nothing to do with that. Yeah, you know what Embiid average in college? Nine points a game. You don't know what Towns average in college? Ten points a game. Do you know what DeAndre Aiden average in college? They all nineteen year old freshmen. You don't know what DeAndre Allen in Aiden average? Twenty points in a game. Weak ass conference. Weak conference. Name somebody. That What's came the difference out of that? between the SEC and the big and the in the Pac twelve? Pac twelve ain't got no. Space. And what the SEC got? And they don't have no big man in the Pac-12. What the SEC really got? Aiden. What the SEC got? Hey, I mean, I'm saying he was in the, but I'm talking about oh, the Pac-12. Yeah, that's really all they got. got do, I mean. I, I, honestly, I don't see Aiden. Vanderbilt. I don't see Aiden putting up those numbers like he did in college. I mean, but it's we gotta see. Why? First don't just, don't all, just give me a first, blanket statement. I, I why? No, no, I will tell you why. First yeah. of all, the way the league is set up now, especially in the West, the big man got to do more than what you stated from him. The big man is pretty much like a flex four. Okay? You look at Embiid. He can't do what Embiid can do. Why not? I don't know, man. It's the same look, size. Why not? I mean, y'all ain't played before, bro. I, I watched bro. about two games yeah. from him. Yeah, yeah, I, watched yeah, ain't enough. I watched about two games. Ain't, ain't enough, bro. I mean, I got to see. I, I mean, Why can't he do what Embiid can do? I just want to know. He's 7'1", 260, 7'6", wingspan. Why he can't? Like Rashad, he got a like David fa- he got, Robinson, I mean, dominant big man. Yeah, you know, like, you know, like, I mean, it's like, like bring a big man. I don't know if you get if you, have impact on the game. Exactly, yeah. if you get one of those, Marcus Cousins, man, like Towns, I mean, all of them. I mean, this goes with Jokic. I mean, all these guys want to shoot. Do. That's yeah. all they want to do is shoot. Yeah, Aiden can take you down low. Yeah, but they okay. He got mid range too. He got a mid range game. Yeah, he he can take you down low. Yeah, he, he can shoot decent. too. What about Devin Booker? Yeah, I know, now Devin's good, but I don't see you now as far as guard play. He barely can bat liquor. But but far as guard, wait a minute. Let's look. <laughs> really? Yeah, he, <laughs> yeah, he's he young. Years old. <laughs> back court for the Nuggets. Man, like that. that back court for the Nuggets. I love it. Yeah. All right. They. I don't see. I don't see them handling them. I think a healthy Nuggets team will be like way better than the Suns. A healthy Nuggets team will be better than the Suns. I agree. I think Nuggets that, made the yeah, playoffs. That's what my I got the, I got the Nuggets making healthy. the playoffs like a yeah, fourth yeah, And that's my true, thing. True. You still haven't told me if they're coming in the West, that means somebody got to go out. So you're saying. I got the Timberwolves and Portland got, coming right, out. Right. Maybe even the Pelicans if Portland. If, 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 if Booby Cousins, Cousins won yeah, the deal. If Cousins leave. Yeah, if Cousins leave, they can't see. They did that one year. Who? Oh, Davis, he came to the playoffs. He had a boy. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, so I mean, I ain't gonna kill him all like they that. Do it again. But I don't know though because because cousins, 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 it's a little litter at the bottom. Yeah, now. and cousins helped him out for so they, many they years. Like he gotta, like, he gotta, like, like, kind of get that seven. back. Who? The, the pals. Yeah. Oh, it was seven. That's at the bottom. I know, like six. Yeah, but they played better than that seed though. It's at the bottom. They swept Portland. I mean, Portland got the best. Well, not the best. Take that back. Yeah, cause you got well, one of the yeah. best backcourts in the West. Yeah, I mean, I say the they probably the let's see, they will probably be third. Five. Yeah, top five. top five. They can't defend nobody. One six three, one six four. You got a combo guy now, in the Lilla point can guard. Defend. I don't know what Lillard. I just don't know what happened to him. Lillard can defend. Already, yeah, Lillard. I already said what I had to say about Lillard. 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 I, think, oh. I just think that he just needs it. I mean, I know that he said right, he wanted to spend his whole career up in up in Portland. Oh, thanks. He doesn't need to leave. He like he that's wasting talent to me. Well, so you know, in the playoffs this year. I don't think that Portland got it. That's what you were saying. Sell them in the playoffs this year, pretty much. You no, know, we're drafting out. I got the Suns. I got the Suns and Denver being the new teams in the West that gonna make the playoffs. Two teams. And, the okay, and you're saying that Minnesota gonna be done. They ain't gonna make it. Possibly. Uh, who's the other one then? I, the, I said. I said Portland. Or- the Portland. 
Portland or the Pelicans. I don't know about the Pelicans. Team ain't that great. It's just not. You got Anthony Davis. You got Cousins who's not going to resign. Uh, I don't think so either. Rondo, Drew Holiday. I mean, uh, Drew is nice though. Drew, uh, Drew he is nice. His ass off in the playoffs. Right. I don't know. Drew man. is nice, but what I'm saying is, what else do you have? Etwan Moore, Solomon Hill. The draft, Those guys play hard though. Yeah, yeah play hard. I play hard. I'm <laughs> trash in basketball. <laughs> Shit, I play hard. <laughs> I foul the fuck out you, but I'm still trash. I'm um, saying. I don't know. I mean, Ron's got they improve, but like that. So they'll show you pretty much, pretty yeah, much what you're saying. Like, show they'll show you. Yeah. They'll show you. I bet you fifty dollars right now on hey. cam on the record. We don't. We don't. Hey. Gonna make we don't bet on cam. You know what I'm saying? Make the playoffs. Y'all take that bet. We bet. You know, behind the scenes. Yeah, but yeah, we, yeah, you know, we don't bet on cam. Make the playoffs. Yeah. DeAndre Ayton at center. DeAndre Ayton at center. TJ Warren at power forward. Small ball. Josh Jackson. Devin Booker. They gonna get them a decent point guard, but right now it's Brandon Knight. They gonna make the playoffs. No, Brandon, Brandon Knight, all right though. Who? And yeah, people sit sleep on right Brandon now. Knight, but only because Brandon Knight yeah, was hurt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 He was hurt most. Yeah. They both tried. They both tried. They both tried. Yeah, really, they both tried. But Suns gonna make the playoffs. I'm paying to be all right if he do his hair. You know, his hair. They cut that though. They think he a monster. They cut that though. Shit about time. I ain't even watching. Let me ask a question. Let me ask a question. Since we're still talking about the draft, who was the ultimate loser mm-hmm. of the draft? I ain't watching that close enough. Seventy six. Seventy six was the ultimate loser in the draft. No they argument. They didn't need nobody to game. No, no. Uh, they didn't need nobody to game. They didn't need anybody. So why they lose to Boston? Why, why yeah, they didn't make it to the Eastern Conference Finals if you didn't need anybody? I mean, we guess Miami 18. You had Ben Simmons. <laughs> you had Ben no, Simmons, Joel well, and B. Well, first of all, let's and, and a bunch of white dudes. Look, they, they would be fine if Ben Simmons could work on shooting game. I mean, that's the main thing. That might take two or three more years. He don't even shoot at all. He don't even look at the rim. I mean, come on. I mean, just grab the rim. I mean, he don't even look at the Took no three-pointers, bro. So pretty much everybody already knew that he he's looking to pass. Yeah, saying. they need help. Yeah, they need. I heard somebody else tell me that Sixers don't need nothing. That's that's garbage. He was sober. Um, just some dude named Marco Bell. I mean, they had to buy dudes well, out from the Atlanta he Hawks. Shoot up anyway, yeah, though. Yeah, yeah, he can't shoot though. They had the bad dudes out from the Atlanta Hawks, yeah, man. Yeah, that's they, they, they had they had the bad dudes <laughs> out. Them, and them dudes it. got significant playing time. That's good, buddy. Yeah. I mean, no arguments here. He's not the one yet, man. No. Well, I think he won. He just can't shoot. Some players just can't shoot. Rondo can't shoot. You know? Yeah, that motherfucker had 17 years of work. Rondo's a facilitator anyway, though. I don't know. Who? Yeah, Ben Simmons. Rondo. Yeah, hell yeah. He had the whole motherfucker. Like, his yeah. career is almost yeah. up. Yeah. Yeah. He still can shoot. Rondo shoot more than Ben Simmons. Rondo shoot three threes a game. Now? Yeah. Yeah, he shoot more than Ben Simmons. Yeah. 12 years in, but yeah, I'm but saying. You can't the, be a, a good point guard without being able to shoot. Like, like you got to at least you gotta be, able to, be able to shoot a little bit. Well, like, Rondo to create a ring and couldn't shoot. Oh, I he didn't shoot back oh, then at all. Like, he, he did. Like, to, but he facilitated, though. He, he did yeah, facilitate, yeah, though. Yeah, Paul Pierce, Ray but Allen, and Kevin Garnett. The story is Philly need more. Yeah. 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 Okay. Philly yeah. need more. I mean, I you, you got JJ Reddick, Bellinelli, Ayala uh, 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 <laughs> Sova, <laughs> Robert Coven. None of them guys can take you off the dribble. Yeah. They want you to, to drive and penetrate and kick it out. Jared they just knock down shooters. That's all they are. I mean, but. Tyson Brown? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, got a bunch of dudes. I mean, <laughs> deep as hell. Like you said, they just they for real, for real, they need they need something. They need a part towards a quiet little. Right. Yeah, I think that they need. But I think they, that's yeah. what they're looking. I think yeah. that's what they're shot. But they didn't act like they needed it in the draft. They well, picked like they, right there. They they picked at number ten. Michael Porter Jr. was right there. They scared of the back. I get it. You don't want to take the risk. I get it. But so so what do they but do? Didn't they gain from that draft two Let future? Let get it. Two future picks for next year. No. They didn't. They I gained from yeah. that draft a 2021 pick yeah. from the Heat. Like three oh, years. Right. <laughs> they picked. They picked Michael Bridges. Okay. Right. The Suns is picking 16. Yeah. They traded their number 10 pick, Michael Bridges, to the Suns for some dude named Zaire Smith. That was a, a, a third star recruit, freshman who averaged 11 points a game. They they traded him for him. Yeah. And the number twenty one pick from the Heat three years from now. Yeah. <laughs> That's what they did. They didn't pick up nothing. They didn't get nothing. 
All he's gonna be is some dude on the bench who can't get off. I love uh, Furcon Kokmas. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, or TJ McConnell, one of them guys. That's all he's gonna be. Alright. Alright, well look, man. You already know we won't, I think we got one more segment. We got one more segment in us or whatever. And then you know what I'm saying, we won't get back to party, you know what I'm saying? We won't yeah, the way we do it. That's right, that's right, that's right, man. And you know what I'm saying, but look, sports based radio, you already know how we doing, man. We're gonna take a quick break. We back at it, man. Let's go, man. <laughs> Man, Sports Base Radio, man, you already know we've been talking a lot. We back, baby, you already know. Hey, man, we got Ace here two, two times, time, nigga, two times. Gotta say it two times. If you don't say it two times, you ain't saying it right. All right, man. What's up, y'all? Got a new project about to come out. Oh, it came out. Ace Gang, man. Ace yeah, gang. it came out, man. Go ahead and yeah. talk to us a little bit about that, man. Tell us what we expecting up in that jump. I mean, honest, man, I had a lot of fun with this tape. You know, I put a lot into it. And the thing I like about it most is, like, the tape, it was growth. Like, I started off, like, kind of rocky. And then gradually through the tape, I got better, and I got better, then I got nice, and I was that's like, man, That's how it's supposed to be, though. Like, that's how it's supposed to be, bro. This is the way I want it, and it's like I come up from the ground, and it's like from my hometown talking about my success, my goals, what I want to do, you know what I'm saying, how I want to be, what kind of voice I'm trying to put out there for uh, like the community right. and all that stuff. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I have fun with this tape, man. I'm right, sorry. Who, who can we expect to be on this mixtape? Right um, here. Shout out to Big Slim, my cousin, my big cousin, and. Shout out to Baltimore. We got my dude Marty Broski. Yeah, yo. yeah. This team is tight. Uh, All right, man, you already know, man. Ace game, bro. Ace, Ace game. game. All right. So look, right now we about to play like a little. This is the loyal track that we gonna play yeah, first. Yeah, I'm definitely trying to push that, man. I, I like, I like that. I like that. All right. So, yeah. so what makes you? What, what makes this song right here stand out for you right now? Cause it's like. And a part of it is going to be like I'm talking about a girl, like a relationship. But right. another thing is like, can you be loyal to me? I'm talking about the people, my my dudes I hang with, like the people that really fuck with me, like family. Yeah, yeah. And can you be loyal to me? Like, you know what I'm saying? You're down for me. And then it's, it's going back and forth type. Yeah. So I fuck with it, yo. Okay. Yeah. All right. So right now, man, we're going to get into like the the loyal song. Let's hear it, man. So it's about yeah. Sports Base Radio. You already know. Let's be y'all. Two times. Two times, two times, two times. Once or twice. <laughs> Can't you be loyal to me? Can't you be loyal to me? I need your honesty. I need your honesty. And this is John's favorite. I like too. Yeah. Ain't the one John. Nah. <laughs> Yeah. 
Oh, that was the 720? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait. Matter of fact, I can go ahead and talk to this one. <laughs> All right, man. You already know, man. That was that was the loyalty jump right there, banger, whatever. I just now told you that I fuck with that jump. Anyway, like right Word before up. we appreciate it. Like before we even started the shit right here or whatever. So, like right now we got the. I need my cash, right? Yeah. Need my definitely. cash. Yeah. Whatever. So the next jump that that you promoted <laughs> is the I need my cash or whatever. Like what's what's special about this song that you wanted to? That it's, made it's more it's more about the money thing, you know what I'm saying? Andy, my cat is self explaining to it, but you know what I'm saying? It's about it's also about coming up, you know. I'm getting money now, I ain't had nothing at first. I ain't had nothing. Exactly. You know what I'm, saying? I'm getting money now, I'm grinding, I'm trying to get out there, you know what I'm saying? And it's not for just me, it's for my team too. People who fuck with me, who whoever do good for you, do good for them. That's right. Whoever sees them back in turn, you know what I'm saying? That's how it's supposed to be. Yeah, sure. Definitely. Alright, man, I need my cash. Let's go. Yeah. 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 Your boy V80 just heard two times. Joy yeah. is fire, two brother. Times. Appreciate it. Much two love, y'all. Two times in two the times. building, baby. Sure. Word up, Ace man. Gang. Love it, baby. Sure, Word up. Ace, Ace Gang. Yo. Uh, Word life, man. Hey, um, this is the questions I gotta ask you, man. What's in up, the bro? next, in the next, I say three to five years, where you see yourself going towards the music scene? Man, hopefully I see myself, I made it already, man. Yeah. I feel like I got that type of potential, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, my voice is already getting out there. I'm getting plays. I'm, I'm being heard, you know what I'm saying? And I'm taking steps way quicker than what I thought I would, you know what I'm saying, that most rappers haven't even done yet, you know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm pushing so for. Sky's you know? limited, yeah, man. definitely, man. Sky's, sky's the limit, limit, man. You know what I mean? Just keep it going and everything. Um, uh, who, so who does your production? I do most of it, and sometimes my cousin will do a little bit too, and we may send it off to somebody and do a little production on it, so it gets passed around, make sure everything crisp, you know what I'm saying? Oh, wow. But um, we're looking for more of a better sound also at the same time, so you can only improve. It's not always perfect. That's the perfect. Wow. Unless you make it perfect. You feel wow. me? Yeah. That's excellent, man. Is there anything that you, um, you get into, like, do you get into a zone, or? Oh, yeah, when I'm in the zone, I'm in there three, four days, maybe a week straight, man. Oh, sure, man. 12, like, six, right, eight, yeah. 12 hours. I'm like, I'm in there, man. That's where I live now. Yeah, so, Locked in the I'm in there. I'm in the mode, man. Oh, I'm man. In the mode. Yeah. Can't great, stop me. Great, man. Yeah. So, um, um, in your next projects that you, that you're upcoming on, um, uh, what do you want to, 
What do you want to touch on? What is your... Oh, you making me reveal my secret, man. <laughs> we got the whole back for that I'm, one, Nah, right? I'm, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, I'm like, you know, Ace Gang, you know what I'm saying? We dropped that, but I'm planning on making it reloaded, so it's coming right after that. You thought the first one was hot, just wait till the reloader come out. Ace Gang reloaded. Audio Mac, go get me Ace Boy. Ace Boy two times. Ace Gang the mixtape. Audio Mac, go get that. SoundCloud too, same thing. Ace Boy two times. Great. Two times. Two times. Two times. Let me, hey. Let me get into it. Ask, ask a couple questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I don't want to cut you. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Come on. Yeah, yeah. You got that. <laughs> I just want to. I just want to know. As you know, we in Virginia, and it is the bread basket. Definitely. Right in the middle between the north and the south. Definitely. Yes. North and the yes. south. And I mean, I just want to know. Do you? Simulate your style more so from as a northern rapper as far as bars and lyrics, or as far as a southern style as far as charisma and and, and, and beats, you know, riding the beat. I mean, what? Because you know, as far as Virginia rappers, it's a middle ground. Right. Yeah, it's a middle which, ground. which side do you more so lean towards? That's a that's a good question, man. But, but um, I think I'm more towards like the southwest or south, like southeastern or something like that. Like it's more in the south because I, I listened to like Lil Boosie back in the day a lot, you know what I'm saying? Get my flow from him, you know, Lil okay. Baby, get a little flow from him, change up in my songs, you know. I got a variety of styles. I try not to be so basic because nobody want to hear the same kind of flow, you know what I'm saying? They want you to hear you change it up. Want to hear you yeah. get a little medley or something like that, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah. Wow, that's dope. That's dope. Wow. Man. Yeah. That's yeah. excellent, man. For sure. Word, man. But hey, man, I give you all my blessings, brother. Appreciate that, Keep man. Keep doing the damn thing. Got to. You feel what I'm saying? Two times is in the building. Definitely two you times. You know what I'm saying? It's already. You're going to hear some more. When is that joint dropping, man? Let me know. Uh, I'm working on shooting some videos right now that's coming. Um, we got a video to No Friends coming out. We got a video to uh, Robbery. And we got another video coming out to um, In the Cut. In the cut, okay. yeah, that's that's uh, that's gonna be on the hot okay. one. That's gonna be a hot one. That's for all the that's for all the that's for all the G's, my G's out there, yeah. But yeah, we got that coming. Um, you know, like I said, reloaded, and we yeah. got another little EP or something like that coming out called Lost Files. Yeah, cool. that's cool. about to be hot too. Yeah. All right, man. Yeah. Word so up, we working, man. we working. It's hey, coming. Keep 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 bringing them bangers. You know what I'm saying? Keep bringing your original style. Cause like I said, man, you know, in this game, man, so many people want to be certain different people. You just come in the game and be you. you yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Right. And you can never go wrong. Right. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. Word right out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be two time, man. You yeah, be two For times. Sure. For sure. All day. Yeah. yeah. And, and, All day. Uh, and don't, you know, don't, don't, don't change your, you know, be, be you. Yeah. That's let, the best way to be, let man. Your, That's the only way you can be successful if you be yourself. Let your charisma speak for itself. Yeah. Let two times speak for itself. Yeah, gotta make a name for myself. Especially in yeah. VA, we don't get we don't we don't get the recognition that we should get. It's so much talent out here, man. And so you basically gotta put a name out here for yourself. And yes. like I wish that everybody in VA would collaborate more because we'll yeah, you know so we man. can do it, but nobody wants to you know speak out like you know right. what I'm saying yeah. I'm, I'm perfectly fine with it. I work with anybody. I didn't already hit people up. Yeah, you know, I don't yeah. work with I didn't collab with other people. You know what I'm right. saying I'm trying to spread. That's how you get your name out right there. Right. You get on other people's shit. Right. Right. You never know right. where they could be, how far they could be from you know making it. You right. know what I'm saying that's one so, thing about Virginia, man. They all collab together, man. They yes. dangerous. Yes, yes. They, they don't. Ooh. You got you got certain artists that that, that hate. Other artists, you got certain yeah. artists that just not really artists. I'm gonna remain nameless, but you got certain <laughs> artists that just hate on, on 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 whatever it is that you're doing, whether it's yeah. it's, it's sports based or whether it's yeah. it's nine to five. Or nine regardless, to five. If, if, if they see you pushing forward or trying to make moves, you know they're they're, they're like, oh, come back. You know they want you to do good, but they don't want you to do better than them. Right. So, and you know I hate people like that because I'm in the business of saying it's selfish. Yeah. 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 I want to see everybody flourish. Yeah. I don't I don't, yeah. I don't care if you're doing better than me. I want you to do yeah. good. Yeah. Like, no, Whether you're yeah. doing better than me or worse than me, right. I want you to do good. Yeah. And everybody don't got that mentality, man. They, they want you. To, they want you to do all right. They just don't want you to be better than them. Yeah. The first time you're better than them. That's they don't like it. And they also don't recognize that it could be an opportunity for them because someone else gets signed. You could be like, hey, yo, wherever you go, take some of my music. What you let them hear? You know, that could be an opportunity yeah. for somebody yeah. else. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and that's what some people need to do. Even when, say, if another person didn't get up there, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Take yeah. that music and let it fly. Right. You know what I'm saying? Put them on too. Right. You know what I mean? They grind it just as hard. 
And then it'd be put on so much quicker, bro. It'd be just like that. Nothing. Yeah, it was flood, man. But, yeah. But I, well, like to anybody, I'm willing to work with anybody, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I said already, it's boy two times is on everything. Everything's the same. Two times. Two times is in the building. Word up. Sports page radio. Two times. Word up. I'll be your boy D80. You know what I'm saying? I got my boy Corn. Got my other man right here. He getting it in. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Dream come true right here. For sure. All collab. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to Sports Base. On the off the field, I work overtime. On the quarter night, I take charge of mine. Beast mode when it's game time. Turn the base up when they play mine. Sports Base, and you know it's live. We on.